what's up everybody tim the collector here on a sunday afternoon finally got around to opening up my avengers number one chase comics i ended up getting two of them so i'm going to open them both here um and we're going to see if we got the avengers number one uh there are about 200 books that uh, went out roughly on this so with that we'll get to it all right we're gonna go with book number one first package number one i should say packing material here so this is the first one I ordered um, again it was $30 I think it was two dollars shipping um, you know a little pricey but if you get that Avengers number one what the heck right uh, and if you get something decent there were some decent books but if you look at the listing there were some decent books so uh, again, the individual claims to take all the books, bag them, double board them, and then just pulls one out and sends it to you. So he doesn't know what you're getting until you know what you're getting, is what he says. So, let's see what the first one is. Now, these are all going to be around the same date you know, as far as how old the books are they're all real similar so this is the first one let's see if we got that Avengers number one. Oh, oh, oh look it's red it could it? no I don't think so oh I see the big green guy so it's a Hulk what do we get? Incredible Hulk 110. Umba, the Unliving. Uh, I think Swamp Men show up in this one too. I actually had this book when I was a little kid. Uh, crazy. <laughs> Kazar's in this thing too. Uh, and Zabu. So, I mean, it looks pretty good. It's probably a 15, 20, 20 dollar book maybe. Um, I believe that this ends with Bruce Banner. Yeah, I man, I remember reading this book as a kid. I'm, I'm kind of happy to have this. It's not Avengers number one, but, um, they do something to the Hulk. They spray him with some gas or something the robot does. Yeah, right here. And it turns him back into Banner. And then Banner basically saves the day, shuts down, uh, whatever it was. I don't remember exactly that was a long time ago maybe it was a weather machine or something. I don't know but it anyway it, it um it shuts down the robot too and then Banner actually dies at the end of this book so um his heart is stopped he has no pulse Bruce Banner is dead Kazar has got him um well, that's kind of a cool book so okay um so, all for one, but that's a neat book. Uh, I had a, that's like one of the first Hulk comic books I think I ever got. So let's see what number two brings us. Uh, again, looking for that Avengers number one. Somebody's gonna get it. Another origami package. I mean, it's, they're in medium mailers, but it's packed decent. Very decent. So we use the envelope inside of it. All right. Let's see what we got. I can already tell you, this is not going to be an Avengers number one. Mm, looks like 
looks like an Iron Man. Doop. Invincible Iron Man 36. So, I actually don't really know anything about this particular book. Um, hmm. Interesting. Ramrod. I don't know. I mean, it's an older, obviously it's an older Iron Man book, so 36? Okay. Um, I don't know. I'm hoping that's a $20, $30 book. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I'll have to look that one up. Uh, it's neat. I like Iron Man. Uh, I'll probably press this one. You see, it's got like crease down the center here and on the back. So it'll be a pressing candidate. I'm doing some pressing today. So um, <clears throat> sending some stuff out. Uh, I'm debating between CGC and CBCS. So if you have had experience with either of those companies, let me know um, how it went for you, uh, which one you recommend. Obviously everyone likes CGC. Uh, I kind of want to try CBCS. They're in with Beckett now. Uh, Beckett's got some ownership stake in them. So I might try that. Um, we'll see. I have not submitted books before. I've, I've just bought slabs. So this will be new for me. Um, so you don't want to go with the CGC membership, but then you get a credit basically, which is essentially the cost of your membership. Um, or do I send them to CBCS who doesn't make you buy anything up front. You just send however many books you want. And if you do buy a membership, it's a couple hours cheaper, but I don't know that it amounts to a whole lot. So let me know your thoughts. And um, did not get that Avengers number one, but we'll have another Chase uh, book probably down the road. I think this individual that I bought these from is Done a couple of them, so I'll be looking out for that. Hope you enjoyed. All right, bye-bye.